Hello everybody and welcome back to the next episode of City Skylines with me Biffa and here we are in the city of New Biffingdale. You may have seen this city before when I had my first look at everything new in the airport DLC and now we are going to build an airport but not just any airport. We are going to try and build the world's largest city encompassing airport. I have no idea how this is going to work. I just it's a mad idea that I've got that I want to build an airport all the way around this city. We've got like 12 million credits that we can spend. Is it going to be enough? And we're doing this normal gameplay. You know, we're not going to have unlock all or anything like that. We're going to just see what we can do. If you've got a city like this, it's got like 132 thousand odd inhabitants i didn't build this city this is the one we're using the red bull challenge one of the challenges you might remember the park challenge but yeah so let's see what we can do let's dive in and have some fun with the new airport dlc okay so here we go this is the city that we're working on remember we had this was our park challenge with red bull that we had down here pretty nice looking city the traffic is pretty terrible so it's gonna be interesting to see how that has affected um as we go along it's already got a cargo airport hub built in here down by the front i think that is the only airport that we've got in this little city here yes it is we've got 142,000 population we're making plenty of moolah um let's just see what the traffic is it's 60 percent and i'm pretty sure yeah i've got despawning on as well but that's how bad the traffic is in this city um, I've gone around and tried to sort of fix a few things up, but, I, you know, we're not concentrating on the traffic today. So just for once, despawning on so we can concentrate on the airport stuff. So the plan that I've got, if we take a look at the squares we've got available to us, we've got all of this around here. And I would like to build an airport that is all the way around here. Maybe a great big long runway along the back here maybe another couple down the side we're gonna have our concourse our terminals all the way around the city that is the plan and i'm be interested to see how well this works out so first of all let's take our airport area and this is going to be the biggest airport area known to mankind it's literally going to start here whoops trying to go in a straight line and then it's going to come all the way along the back avoiding these parks and then it's going to come all the way down the side here and connect up what's going on there why can't i go across there what can i go around it what uh what i'm confused so what we just remove that one so i can come down here but i can't go across what is this it's a railway line with some trees and a waste processing complex what is the problem of drawing past here? I can make it larger. Yep, can't go any further around there. That is odd. Oh, I've worked out what it was. It's because we'd run out of soil. Because, of course, this flattens the land as you're going around. And we'd completely run out of soil. And because this dipped down down here, it was trying to, yeah, flatten that all out. Well, that makes sense, doesn't it? There we go. So we've pretty much removed all the trees, which is something that... <laughs> painting this area in should do but if you do it too quick it doesn't remove all of the trees so let me just get rid of all of those there we go this area is looking fantastically ready so this is going to be called like our city new biffingdale let's just copy that let's just change that new biffingdale airport excellent so we need to build an airport terminal aircraft stand and build a runway so let's just jump into here and jump into here and we don't get access to anything other than terminals at the beginning um i would like to go for the ultra modern and we've got these two different options here um i'm just wondering what the noise is of these it doesn't show on the screen noise pollution 50 so that's not too shabby so let's see maybe where we could fit this in along here. I'm just wondering whether we could build... We've got this road. Build a gigantic ring road that can help us to hook into. I think that might be an idea. There we go. So we've got this ring road hooked in. And what I'm doing is I'm just going along and I'm putting this down as no limit. Because I think as it's running around the outside of the city, 
Let's give it no speed limit as well. Get some more people using this. And I've also made sure to hook it up to the city. Every time there's one of these large six lane roads coming down from the city, I've hooked that into our ring road as well. So hopefully that's going to alleviate some of the traffic. Uh, that the city's been facing as well. But it's certainly going to give us plenty of space for where to build our airport. So let me just get this finished. And then we'll start popping in some airport terminals. And seeing if we can level this bad boy up. So we can start building some of the cool big stuff as well. Okay, so I'm thinking of starting along the top here with our first terminal. I and mean, we could use all of the terminals, couldn't we? Because we've got loads of them here. But let's take this one first. Uh, the ultra modern airport terminal. And I'm going to put that... Oh, yeah, you can't actually put it on the road. You can put it next to the road. Like... Uh, let's go like that. Oh, there we go. Excellent. We've unlocked some stuff. This is everything that you get in level one. There we go. Very nice, very nice. And then we can hook that road into here. So let me just do that. Okay, there we go. Terminal number one is in. I feel like we need a few more terminals. Now, something I want to test is we get concourse, of course. We can build. Of course, we get concourse. But is this going to be a problem when we get to things like this? Well, apparently, we can anarchy stuff straight through other stuff. Who knew? I wasn't sure that was going to work with concourse. What we can't do is go up or down. That is something that's not going to work. So we're going to need to sort of work on our road layout so what i would like to do is draw this all the way along here and mirror what we have with our roads and then we can connect other terminals up to this so i'm just going to anarchy this straight away over the top of everything else there we go and then we can for instance come along let's have a look so there's a lot of people living here um there's this sort of road we could have another one down here so maybe we'll go for the two tier one over here and actually with anarchy on i think if we just delete that yeah actually that's the way to do it do it like that then we can hook that back up again and i've just got to connect these roads in okay there we go that one is hooked in as well i believe these are going to all need water pipes as well so let me just run those around and of course power we're just going to drop a power line over the top of that road there i think that will work perfectly fine and man this is causing a lot of traffic even though <laughs> there's nothing going on here yet i think there's a lot of people using this for absolutely no reason at all mm, okay we'll work on that right so we've got one there we've got one there uh, maybe we'll just go for that at the moment and then we'll upgrade as we go so we've got access to towers so we're gonna add um where should we pop that let's just pop that we'll pop that next to it over there and we can always move it later if we wish can i fit that one in there oh i've got anarchy on have a nice that's maybe not a good idea to do that while we're placing these things because you don't want them going over the road no, that's okay we'll we'll move that control tower momentarily right and then if we come out of this and have a look here we've got access to taxiways and runways and we've got access to small aircraft stand excellent so what is going to be a good way of laying this out? I'm thinking we could just have some small aircraft stands out the back of both of these. I mean, we've got so much money. It's just not funny, is it? We've got no problem at all with what's going on here. Uh, these are going to have to be connected like that way, aren't they? So we'll do that. And then this. I mean, are we just going to keep connecting everything all together like that? And then we're going to have to work on what's going on with our road system over here. Bear with, bear with. Well, that worked really well, didn't it? I thought that was going to turn it all nicely into underground tunnel segments. Hang on, let's go back. Another couple there. I think that's okay. And then I'll just use the move it mod to move it all down a bit. Okay, so everything that should be underground is either going underground or overground. So this is all open and free. Fantastic. So now we <laughs> need to run... Oh man, we need to put a load more stuff underground once we've done this. We need to run our runway. Now, I'm wondering whether to have one big runway come straight down the middle here, as long as it can be, which all of these can connect to. So maybe let's give that a try. Uh, I'm going to pause the game again because I want to make sure that this is all nice and level with everything else. So let's put on our road guidelines. 
I'm going to come out, let's say, to there. Yeah, I think that's long enough. How much did that cost me? Doesn't say how much that cost me. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Handy. So I'll do this along here, and then we'll go down there, connect that up, and then I'll just remove these. Eek. There we go. And that's where... Darn it. That's where our runway is going to go. Okay, interesting. Even with anarchy on, it's not letting me draw it there. But I can line it up with that. There we go. So that's where it's going to be, across there. Now, this is interesting. It's not letting me draw out over here to attach onto here. So I'm wondering, once you've drawn a, one, oh, a runway, one way, one way that you're not allowed to attach another one to it. Yeah, look at that. Now, that is interesting. So, I am playing on a pre-released version. Not all mods that you see are going to be 100% updated. So, this issue that I'm seeing now may be totally fixed. Oh, I wonder if it was that. Maybe totally fixed when this comes out for you. Yeah, it's not letting me do it there. So, don't worry. Uh, I'm sure this will be sorted. So, what I'm thinking I might just do is draw out some marker guideline roads like this so i'm going to get rid of this move those out of the way and now see if i can just connect that thing up from one end to the other if i go next to that there we go we get our lines let's see what happens so with anarchy i'm going straight across all these other things yeah that's no problem at all is it now right we're making this right up to the end uh, over here there we go excellent oh my goodness look at the length of this runway this is absolutely gigantic so the runways that we put down the two edges are going to have to be separate runways because we can't curve the runways around <laughs> which wouldn't really make any sense anyway would it wow that is looking good okay let's connect these up so uh, my understanding, if I remember correctly, is if we get these and we can... Can we connect them anywhere? No, there is a connection section. There we go. So if we come out like that and come along... Yeah, we can go over all of these roads. No problem, no problem. And then we'll come up to here. Oh, look at that. That is good. And we can turn that around. So they can now connect here. There we go. And then that will continue along here. Hopefully this is all still nice and straight. There we go. Excellent. Oh, yeah, hang on. Yeah, we want this to come all the way down here because that's going to have to connect in there. Yeah, have I got that going the right way round? So they're going to come in and land. Yeah, I need this the other way around, don't I? <laughs> Let's turn this all around. There we go. Excellent. And then that should be okay here. They can come in there. Then they can come along this way. Then they can come up and go over there. Brilliant. So that's got to go up. That's good. I think that's it. I think that's working okay. So to make sure this all works nicely, of course, this needs to run in the opposite direction. So they can come in and land. They can come around here. Do, 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 do. They now get access into here. Access to the stand and they can leave there if they like. Or they can come along. Access to this stand and they can leave there. So we probably don't need that one there. But I am going to pop another one in the middle here just in case any of the planes want to be stupid there we go excellent so let us check our area so we need lots of attractiveness hmm so where else can we add some terminals i think we could use some of these other terminals as well because these will all hook into these ones absolutely no problem at all so let's pop in a couple down here there we go some nice asymmetric roads coming out excellent and that one is ready to go and why not let's just pop a classic there we go classic control tower i know that's not maybe exactly the right place but then again i mean you get a good view of the world's biggest airport so why not why can that not be the correct place to do it and then i reckon another one over here and this time let's go for the modern style one of these there we go that's looking very swish uh let's put in here a modern control tower alongside this one excellent 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 so we've got one two three four down here and we're still only at 85. Okay, so we must have some other things that we can add in here. Oh, of course, we need to put in some more stands, don't we? 
Uh, they haven't all got stands, so let's hook these up as well. I'm sort of using the width of the terminal as the guideline for where I put the stands on these, just because of no other reason than uh, I want to. There we go. Oh, there we go. Everybody's hooked up and we had a plane. What happened to the plane? He appeared and just disappeared straight away. Darn it. Okay, we're, we're waiting for our first ever plane to turn up. I don't think that one counted. No, it didn't. Mm, okay, what are we up to? What are we up to? 85. Right, let's have a look and see what other delights we can add in here. So, we have a budget airport hotel. Uh, we are going to have one of those. Mm, let's have a look. Right next to the road to every way. That one can be between the road. There. Yep, that one there. This one here can be this side. There we go. And then our fourth one, that can be that side as well. That should have added 150. We're getting so close. Oh, we're getting so close. Then we've got small hangars and planes. What else have we got in here we can add? Oh, yeah, we've got our airport bus station. Oh, now that's good. Why don't we add that into the middle here? And I'm wondering whether we can have like a shuttle bus road that just runs along the back. And hooks that up and brings people in. I think that would be pretty cool. I'm going to just move this over a bit. So to give us a little bit of space with that road there. So yeah, let me see what I can do. Okay, so the bus line runs all the way along the back over here. So let me just run some buses from here to various points in the city. I'm just looking around to see what we've got. So things like this, we've got a train station... Uh, that can come in here. That was meant to be a metro, I mean, and go back again. So I'm looking for big hubs of activity, like this one here. I mean, this is a long way to go to get a bus to come all the way over here. You would just jump on the metro and come over here, but we're going with it because we want to bring in as many people as we can, and we know if the lines are there, people are going to use them. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. That is what we're going to do. And because this is just having a laugh, messing around, testing things out, I'm not going to worry too much um, about the lines being perfectly placed or anything like that. We are just testing how big we can make this airport and get it still working. There we go. Excellent. So I'd like to try some of the new bus buses that we've got. So let's just zoom in here so I can see the lines that we've got. There we go. So is that 30, 29, 28 and 27? It is. Okay. So I think we'll go double-decker, articulated, double-decker, articulated. How many buses are we getting on each of these lines? 15 on that one, so the rest aren't going to be too bad. Okay, excellent. So hopefully that will start bringing some more people in along here. And then finally, let's use some of these decoration items that we've got here to get ourselves up to 200. And the water pipes under the planes where they belong and there we go 1065 out of 200 so we've got enough attractiveness to last us for a while so it's just a case of waiting for our passenger count to go up so here i am at the end of the runway waiting for a plane to arrive i can't believe we haven't actually seen any yet my eyes are fixed on the sky. Oh, 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 we might have one. We might have two coming into land. Cargo airport hub. Darn it. What about this one here? Cargo airport hub. Oh, oh I missed it. Here we go. Our first airplane landing. Small passenger plane with 70 passengers. Oh, my life. This is absolutely brilliant. Let's just follow this and see where it goes. I'm not quite sure which one it's going to pick, but it's a, a long way down. Six and a half hours later. Is this, is this the longest taxiway ever? It's been like three extra long Marvel movies just to get to the end of this thing. And we're still going. I, I think I'll have a quick sip of tea while I'm waiting. Yeah, more tea, please. I finished all of this one. This is like my 12th cup since we landed.
And here we go, coming along the taxiway. Let's hope that they're not going all the way to the other end. That would be... Because <laughs> they're going even slower now. <laughs> Let's enjoy the model. That is a fantastic looking aeroplane. I'm loving the look of that. Very nice, very nice. Oh, okay, they're cutting around the back. Does that mean they're going for one of the nearer ones? Oh, there's another plane coming in over there, look. Yes. So that's got 50 passengers in it as well. They're all going to be small ones until we've unlocked the larger gate. But that'll be 100. I can't remember exactly what we need. Right, let's watch the animation. And it disappears and they all jump out. Excellent. That's, <laughs> that's great. Okay, so there's one there. So they're starting to kick in, which is good. So let's have a look. What are we up to? 380. Fantastic. So I'm not quite sure what that's counting, but yeah, I just want to check all of my taxiways are all working correctly in the right direction. It looks like they are. So I'm putting a way in and a way out before each of these. So hopefully if they're coming to the far one. They'll take this line here and not get in everybody's way down here. Hey, there we go. Now we're at level two. Large hangar, luxury airports, even more concourses and terminals, fuel stations, all sorts of fantastic things. I'm liking the look of that. Okay, here we go. We've got another plane turning up and I've made a few additions to our little runway and taxiway setup here. Um, so we've now got nicely, we've got nice corners over here. We've got nice ins and outs and I've sort of made these a little bit longer. So we've got a separate throughway. So hopefully they don't get stuck behind each other. That is the plan, but we need to expand. We need to add some more now that we've reached the next level. How are we doing passenger wise? Oh, I put some... Uh, Okay, can I have that open? There, there we go, excellent. Put some policies on, hotel discounts, 200 bonuses to the airport's attractiveness, cost us some money. Oh, and I turned that one up by mistake. And a land value one. This one I've not done. I don't want them to use cars. That's a way of making more money. Um, but I'm fine with the amount of money our city's making. So yeah, doing okay. They've gone up. So now we can start looking at, I mean, what do we want to add next? I'd like to try and add one that's got metro built into it so i'm thinking that's going to be our large terminal our two-story one doesn't because in this city we do have metro let's just have a look at that we've got metro running all over the place so i reckon if i can hook into that we are going to be onto a winner now there's nothing to stop you once you get to a certain level is ripping things out and redoing them uh <laughs> which is a real bummer because the shape that i've built here how about we just add in some extra ones like this okay let's see what we can do in this spot oh i'm liking that um, it's not totally even but i'm liking that right uh should we get these roads hooked up as well we need more traffic down here don't we <laughs> like we haven't got enough already let's just check this thing out um i've just basically hooked it up nothing too complicated we've got the arrivals at the bottom the departures at the top and already people are walking through here which is great um we need i mean they can come in here and walk along here and get into these stands down there so that is not the end of the world but we do have some larger stands now available to us i believe let's have a look what have we got here medium aircraft stands so is there a way i can sort of pop these in here yeah this thing was not in the middle at all was it okay well, i'm going to pop both of these over this side if it'll let me oh over here need a bit of space and then we'll hook these up as well Okay, there we go. We've got one, two, three, four medium plane stands on there. So hopefully we'll start seeing some medium planes coming along here soon. And then let's get this thing hooked up to the metro. We've got a metro line running through right there, which is absolutely fantastic. So I'm going to hook up to that. Okay, there we go. Nothing complicated. So I'm just going to grab this line here. There we go. And add a stop in there going in that direction. Then I think I'm also going to grab that line and have that stop going in the other direction. So actually, we don't need this little bit <laughs> down here anymore. But hopefully, that's going to bring in. So that's stopping here. That's stopping here. Yeah, that's going around the largest parts of our city. We've got lots of residential in there. So hopefully, that's going to help bring even more people in. Whoa, finally, we've hit level three three and we've now unlocked so many new things large aircraft stands cargo aircraft stands now these cargo stuff 
is going to be fantastic to look into and setting up our own airline as well excellent oh i'm just admiring the paintwork on this beautiful plane look at that that is a sleek looking aircraft and because i hadn't thought of it before i'm going to take our terribly aligned uh, bus paths that we've got uh, and try and get some of them to come up here there we go, where the metro is coming through. Excellent, so we can try and bring some more people down here on our <laughs> ridiculously long... I mean, I don't know how long this is. I've worked it out. Hang on, somebody told me how big the squares were and how long this is going to be. One second. Okay, thank you to Dog1 on my Discord. At one side of a zoning square, it's eight meters. So the side of one map square is 1,920 meters. And then we need to do a little bit of math. So that's 1,920 times 5, because it's 5 tiles long. That's 9,600 metres. And then we need to convert 900, the 9,600 metres to miles. And that's where we get to our just shy of a 6 mile long runway. Wow. And you can see I've started to build a second one along the side here. I don't think I mentioned that before. Good gravy, Miss Daisy. Oh, and here we have our first medium plane. Leaving the new medium plane stand. Looking rather swish as well. I really hope that they've got... Um, I really hope they've got those uh, automatic walking path things that you get. You know, ground level escalators that you get at airports. Because travelling down this thing with kids in tow is going to be a right flipping nightmare. Oh, hey, uh, welcome back. Uh, yeah, I'm adding in um, some more metro... If I can get underneath here. There we go. All the way up to the other side of the airport. Oh, dear. Uh, this is getting a bit difficult. Where the heck is this one going to go in? Can I connect that one to there? Oh, I can. Excellent. So now we can have a stop going from there to all the way down to here. And then we can also grab this stop. Okay, hang on. Oh, I've got to finish that one off first, haven't I? <laughs> That's going to be like a shuttle. There we go. Inside our humongous terminal. And then we're going to grab that stop. Move that up to there. So they should be okay. And then make sure that we get our other stops in there. Yeah, I think that's okay. Hopefully that'll work all right. But there we go. Look, we've got this one added up here as well. Getting a little bit of traffic in this area, but it is super, super busy. And more and more planes are turning up as well, which is great. So I just need to adjust this and add some more um, of these plane stands up here. And of course, now we have access to large plane stands. Uh, so I'm going to put uh, three or four of these along here and have a little bit of space in between them. That can go there. That can go in before it curves around. Excellent. And then hopefully we can get all of these hooked up as well. Oh, here they come. The big planes are finally landing. Look at that thing. Looking fantastic. So with what we've got so far, our nearly six mile long runway and all the accoutrements that come along with that to make this a humongous working airport, what would you like to see next in the city? Some ideas for you and you can let me know in the comments as well. Shall we wrap this around the side here and connect up all these other areas at both ends? Whereabouts shall we put a cargo airport? Maybe we can run it in along the front here with a separate runway to remove this one. Maybe even down the side with a super duper long one as well. What do you reckon? Let me know in the comments below. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on that extra fun we're going to be having with this airport DLC. And thanks for your continued support. Have a fantastic day. Take care. Bye bye.